Hi, my name is Dave Caldwell. I'm the technical trainer for Conrad's Tire Express and Total Car Care. I've been in the automotive industry as a technician and a technical trainer for over 30 years now. And we've created these videos to give you kind of a better understanding of what happens in the shop when your car is being repaired. The topic we're going to cover today, we're going to try to make some sense out of that numbering system for your tire sizing. The tire we've chosen today is a P215 60R16 94V. The 94V is what's called the service description and we'll get into that later in another video segment. So let's break this down. This one says it's a P. Well the P stands for passenger car tire. Some of you that are driving pickup trucks, you might have an LT at the beginning. LT stands for light truck. The first set of numbers, the 215 on this, is what we call the section width of the tire. Bottom line, in plain English, that's the width of the tire mounted on the rim. But it's in millimeters, so this tire is 215 millimeters wide. The next one that it talks about inside this thing is the 60, so 215, 60. 60 is the height of the sidewall. It's what we call aspect ratio, and it is a percentage number. That means that this sidewall is 60% as tall as it is wide. The next one on there is going to be the R. R stands for radial design. That means that underneath the tread, there's going to be a steel belt package that helps prevent, I didn't say stop, helps prevent tire punctures and, and helps eliminate leakage in it. The next one is, is the 15 or 16 or 17. In this case, it's 16. That is the rim size on your vehicle. So it's critical that you match up what is recommended for your vehicle, which you can find on the side of your tire, but the best place to find it is on your door placard. That will ensure that you're putting the right tires on your car. Thanks for watching the video today. If you have any more questions, visit us at econrads.com or stop into one of our local neighborhood locations. Conrad.